Right guys, today we are back with the the neutral vlogs today. World Cup is starting in a couple of days. I'm not really going to Qatar, so there is no Villa game. So I thought today I'd come along to a neutral game. Today we are here near Stoke for Port Vale versus Charlton. Of course, there's a League One fixture. I don't really know too much about the two clubs. Um, but I think Port Vale currently sitting 17th and Charlton are currently mid-table in 12th. So, you know, it's definitely going to be an interesting game today, isn't it? No. I actually was at the game where Port Vale got promoted last season. The, uh, the game at Wembley when they beat Mansfield. And I think Port Vale are doing okay uh, for where they want to be uh, where they want to be at this current point in the season. I know Charlton do score a lot of goals. They drew 3-3 to Burton last weekend. They beat, uh, they, they drew 4-4 to Ipswich a couple of weeks ago and they beat they beat Colville 4-1 Colville, in the FA Cup so they do like to score a lot of goals I'm not expecting too much from today's game but we're in the away end we're in the Charlton end let's hope for a good atmosphere it might be a good game we'll see no Villa game so I thought I'd bring some content we are in Port Vale so uh, yeah up the up the Charlton up the Reds come on that guy is so yeah, such a cockney I love it Right, so we've just come off the train at Stockport, I think it's called, and this has to be the longest walk I have ever done to a stadium. It says it only took half an hour, but it feels like we've been walking for about half an hour, and we're still 20 minutes from the stadium. So, yeah, my hair is absolutely terrible. Oh, nah, I never knew that. We'll collect our tickets as well. We've got a bit of an issue for our tickets, but Port Vale seems like a, a, re a really nice place. It's, it's just really dull. There's nothing here. Can confirm, there is literally nothing in Port Vale. Stadium is supposed to be up there, but there's n there's no sign. This is, yeah, this is great. We're in the stadium. It's actually not as bad as I thought it was going to be. It's a little bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. And you're also allowed to sit wherever you want at Port Vale, which is a bit interesting. But we're here. Not bad. We're in the game. We've got some food. The sausage roll ain't great. Security, probably the best security I've ever seen in a football match. And we're in League One. He literally fully searched my pockets completely. Good job I didn't have any uh, flares or knives in there. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Kind of sums up Charles first half. Just side to side football. We've got the ball. Oh, here we go. Been about 40 minutes into the game. Nothing much happened in the game. Not even really been a shot on target, but the atmosphere's all right. Charlton fans getting frustrated. Paul Bell actually played some decent football, to be fair. Nearly half time. Nothing much is happening. Yeah. I'm on the Charlton. We're the right side of the pole. We're the right side. We're the right side. We're the right side of the pole. 
probably the most entertaining thing of the first half. With a run! So, first half, it's 0 0, half time. Bit of a boring first start to be fair. I think the game started okay and I think it was an alright game, but apart from that, Vale have had a couple of chances to be fair. Port Vale have played some decent football, but Charlton have never really got into the game. There's, I don't even know if Charlton had a shot on target, but it's an even game, there's not much in it. Vale have had a couple of chances, Charlton haven't, so we'll see what happens in the second half. I want a goal, I want limbs, I want Paros, I want all of that. I don't want to come here for a nil nil, so uh, come on, the Charlton. Come on, score prediction, second half. No, because we didn't play well to the second half, so I'm going to say 2-1. 2-1, 2-1. Come on, big second half. They keep opening themselves up. Every time. Come on. Da, 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 da. Also, this lighting is terrible for the video. Look at that. It was probably coming to be fair. It's a decent finish, but the defenders are very good from Charlton. Come on, have faith. Come on. Have faith. Have faith. We're just watching. Ha. Ah. 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 It's just a little bit. Go. Come on. Oh, it's just drop. Go on. Go on. How has he got the ball? Fucking useless. Fucking useless. We're in about 15, 20, 15, 10 minutes left, Charlton. <laughs> Not been good. I don't think Port Vale have been particularly good as well, but you can see the fans' frustration. It's a long night, it's a long way back to London for Charlton fans. But... Yeah, mate, it's five hours. Five hours. Oh, oh. Charlton fans through their own players. A little bit of fan trouble. Right, so we're doing the long walk back to the train station now. Well, it wasn't really worth it to be fair. Charlton weren't very good. I mean, in the second half, they had one or two chances, but that is about it. I don't think Port Vale either were particularly amazing, but they took their goal well. The play, I don't know who scored, but was a good goal, went past a couple of Charlton players, got there before the Charlton player and put it away in the bottom corner. But the atmosphere in the first half was really good from the Charlton fans. Like, genuinely, it was a good atmosphere. And then they conceded and it went very toxic. Lots of boos, lots of swearing to their players at the end. But, yeah, it's a mid-table clash in League One at the end of the day. I don't think either teams are going to be too, too bothered with that result. It's a big win for Port Vale just because they want to stay up. But overall yeah you guys enjoyed charlton fans you were very good to be fair I met a lot of decent people um port vale probably did deserve the win so either of you two teams share the video around like and subscribe i'm really close to 12,000 subscribers guys so if you are new make sure to subscribe see you all soon they'll win they'll win every single time i see them play so nice and uh yeah